All right. Back at it. More historic rank. Let's see how we do. Forget what my Lucia was two of four, then a three of five. So I'm seven of nine, six of nine. Math is bad, especially for me. Either way, we're taking it one game at a time against Obardo. He's got more fancy things on his name than I do. Here we go. I got a new dog. He's purple. Or is that pink? No, that, that's clearly pink. And he does this. Flies around super fast. He's pretty low on the list, I gotta say, compared to the other ones. I think I'll still go with floppy-eared German Shepherd. Still waiting on the other guy to get in, I'm assuming. So I'm here. I'm ready to go. Come on, buddy. Any minute now. Maybe. Question mark. Hmm. Hmm. But anyway. I'm uh, wondering if, also along with this deck, if I should try to come up with another historic deck, but uh, I want to do it around a uh, deck I've at least, um, or not a deck, do it around a card that's weird, or at least has a cool name, because I kind of do it with Tiny Bones. Tiny Bones is a cool name. So I'll have to go looking through what's available for maybe like I forget what the those cards are actually called that have that fancy border on them that you're only allowed to have one out at a time maybe I'll just look around for one that's like oh I haven't seen one of you before maybe we'll uh maybe we'll go with them I'm gonna go ahead and just start with this hand it ain't great I mean we can't play anything for three turns hopefully I'll get something within my uh 53 cards that'll let me play something on at least turn one, maybe turn two. Again, all about discard. Basically getting rid of everything in their hand. Uh, trading well enough so if I have to, I can Liliana to kill things with the minus three ability. But in order to do that, I gotta have stuff in the graveyard. And ideally, if I have enough mana to do so, Send uh, Little Weenie to die, only to have it come back as a stronger zombie because of this guy. Or this guy, if anybody dies, also can ping him for two life. I don't know if uh, our opponent is here. I think it times out after this one. Or I've got one more timeout. I don't remember. I think it's three. We'll find out. Nope. The best kind of win. The one I didn't have have to raise a finger. Do I go up a level? No, I'm very close though. Oh, I did. I ranked up to bronze tier two. Cool. Easiest win of my life. Ain't got to do anything for it. Pretty close to getting a mythic rare, which I think is the high. Yeah, that's the highest one. Back at it again. I don't know if I should count that as a win, but... I mean, they gave us the rank points for it. Need to open the door a little bit. Get that AC in here. It is very warm outside. This one, not great, but at least I got some things to dump some hands. I'm going to wait to see if this guy scries. And if he does, then I'll go ahead and... Uh, he didn't. All right. Looks to be some sort of green-black... Nothing on turn two, a little unfortunate. We got, if I can get another land, hopefully, I got something on turn three. I'm a little uh, concerned, because he's doing the same thing. Oh uh, yeah, I'll get rid of the zombie. And you know what? You do the same thing. You get rid of a card, see how you like it. Two can play this game. Clearo. You had 
sacrifice. Well, let's just trade. Alright, so he has something on the next turn, which may be another burglar rat. Or more discard. He did not. Uh, there's Waste Knot, unfortunately. I'm just not getting a uh, card I want. You're going to turn into a 2-2 zombie, so no attacks. Please give me a land. Sacrifice something. What does this say? Uh, let's see. The thing, it does another discard. That's fine. All right, well, you know what? Get rid of your cards, buddy. Either give me mana, or give me cards, or give me a zombie. That was two creatures. Give me two zombies. Uh, nothing yet. See if he sacrifices that burglar rat for anything. He's got to have something. To, yeah. X proof cannot be blocked by black creatures. Well, let's see. We will. Burglar rat. Let's get rid of your other card. What do you got? Perfect. Now, um, I mean, this vine mare is unfortunate. No attacks. What do you have in here that I could take? What are you? Eh, done. Uh, you probably have a thing. No blocks. All right, uh, Liliana Steward. We're gonna go ahead and tell you to get rid of your card. Whatever you got, buddy. Another creature, huh? Nope, you're another eternity. Um, no attacks. Because we're, we're fine. If I can get a Liliana Steward, that'd be great. Field of Ruin we didn't get, unfortunately. Um, now, though, Eldest Reborn will come out. I probably should have played this a little better to get rid of something, but he's going to put it back there. I got Lifesteal. That's fine. Burglar Rat goes away. And, uh, let's, uh, have you start losing some life. I don't know why you tapped that, but you did. No attacks. Now you're down on land. I mean, you're going to discard a card this turn. That's fine. Uh... Seven. He needs eight, right? Creature from the graveyard. Ooh, hello. Discard a card. Cage zombie. Now we're going... Oh, I should have fielded ruined that. I'm dumb. That's fine. Uh, let's see. We're going to cancel first. I want to see. What can I do? Minus seven does what? I want you... Yeah, I want you to be seven. So, nothing yet. No attacks. Next turn, I can start uh, taking things out of his yard. and uh, Or graveyard, I should say. Well, yard, it's the same thing. If I can get a tiny bonus, that would be great. What are you going to do? Destroy? That's fine. Whatever. I am not concerned. Are you going to attack? Because uh, you're going to want to. So everything's attacking now. That's fine. Zombie go. Burglar rat go. Uh, that's enough. So he's focusing on that. That's fine. Liliana Stewart. Uh, what's good here? That Relic Seeker seems real good. Death Bloom Thalid would be fine. Pearl Harpooner actually goes against the... Uh, gets rid of the Vine Mare. So I am okay with that. We're going to get rid of that. We don't want that. Let's just 
never see that card again. Goodbye. I don't think you have enough. You do not have enough, buddy. Or do you? No, you need five. You don't have five. Thank you. Come on. Ooh, I just bent away. That really hurt my... Hurt my back because I'm a giant baby. Well, now what we're going to do is uh, keep pinging away at you. No in and no attacks because unless you find a way to get rid of the harpooner. I got your number with that. Got you. And you know what? We'll get rid of you. Lock. Ah, hello, Tiny Bones. Just what I'm looking for. Do some more milling. Keep pinging away at you. And you're dead next turn. Does not matter. Actually, I need another land. <laughs> I better hope I pull one. Uh, I did not. Well, that's fine. We're gonna keep going at it. And, uh, yeah. You're gonna have to hold back in the Vine Mare. You cannot attack with it. So, what are you gonna do? Ah, you yourself have one, huh? Alright, we'll get rid of you. So, hopefully. Okay, you're desperate. Goodbye, you. Goodbye to you. Yep, now he realizes. Got to our cards, thankfully, before he did. Feeling good. Feeling great. That was mainly just me getting the cards I needed before he did. So, what did I get for a card? Wildwood Scourge. Uh, whenever one or more counters are put on a non-hydro creature, you put one on this guy, too. That's not bad. I don't like hydras. I always lose to them. Alright, let's do a few more. I'm bound to lose. It's gonna happen. I'm either gonna play absolutely terribly, which is very likely, or I'm just gonna get screwed on card draw. If I had to... Chalk it up to what's going to be the thing that's going to kill me more often. It's my inability to play. Yes, you'll have those games where you just don't draw what you need, but... You know, random chance is only a certain percentage of the time. The rest of it, you, it it's, it's user error. You can always be like, come on, if I only got the card I needed. But that only gets you so far. Come on, we're the opponent. Quote-unquote see if I can do any better. Keep improving. Go up a rank, because I don't think I've gone up two ranks in a uh, in a uh, video yet. I mean, this is the third one, so. There we go. Here we go. Did I just immediately win? Or is this like a lag out draw? Yeah, I think we both just timed out. Waste of time. Can I get off the screen now? From the BMG Ghost Council. Ghost Council, excuse me. I think that's like the th second or third time ever that's happened to me. So we had the first win was just a timeout. Second one was actually we got to play. Third one. Maybe I was on the other guy's hand when I was just never actually able to connect to the game and I got a draw, but he got a win. I don't know. All right, Mal Gusick. We both have the same little icon. 
All right, so nothing turn one, but we do have waste not turn two. I'm really glad I got field of ruin in there, ruining anybody's uh, anybody's day. Oh, he's had to mulligan once. Does he mulligan twice? He has sixty cards in his deck, as do I, along with my Yoshitaka Anno card uh, cover. We're gonna go straight off with field of ruin. Let him not know what I'm doing to start with. Blue white. Good to know. All right. Well, I don't think he's got anything off the bat to get rid of an enchantment, but if he does, he does. We're going to do Shadow Mage turn three. Let's see what he plays. If it's blue white, there could be potential for some sort of control. Turn two, there are banishes, I believe. Okay, he didn't do anything, which makes me a bit concerned, but we're going to go Shadow Mage to start with. He's got to have a counter for this. Yep. Okay, that's fine. That was only a one cost? Ah, because it was that thing. Uh, it's a little unfortunate. I am now... Um, maybe I should get rid of the Castle of Antress to start with, but... We're going to do Cage Zombie and see if he has something for that, and he does. <clears throat> Will he counter it? He does not. He lets it go. He may have a Banish of some sort. No, he's just got an Opt. So, depending on what he actually ends up playing this turn, I may Murderous Rider on my turn. Because he's going into four. No, nothing. Interesting. Well... We're going to go ahead and uh, force him to do something. He's thinking about it. And go ahead and attack. He can't scry just yet. So we're going to play the zombie now and see if he counters that. He's probably going to. Nothing. All right. End turn. Revitalize. Okay, that's fine. Really holding back on his cards. Still holding back on his cards. Well, is he going to do anything? Still not. Uh... We'll play this. We'll see. We'll force out another uh, counter. Because he's got to have him by now. It's going to buff my zombies. He realizes that. So go ahead and counter it. He does not. End turn. All right. He's got to have an opt or another revitalize. Yep. Okay. Uh, do I play tiny bones now? No. I think there might be like a time warp they can do in turn four. Play all of your mana so I can Murderous Rider it. He is not, though. Liliana Stewart goes out. We'll see if he uh, does anything with this. He does not. All right, next. He's got to get rid of that Devotee. Yeah, he's probably looking to do so right now. I can Murderous Rider counter it. Alright, so, I mean, if he's got more Revitalizes, he can play them now. Jumpstart. He's just looking for the perfect card draw here. Uh, I don't want to get rid of Vantross. I don't think it's worth getting rid of Castle Vantress yet. It sucks I'm not getting my mill that I need. Alright, Tutelage. He's a miller. So this is what he was waiting on. A bunch of card draw. So this will be the turn I gotta probably dump into him here. He did discard it, so now I'm gonna get um That's fine, mill two cards. I am gonna get his um uh, I drew a card off it, that's fine. Scry it, that's fine. I'm gonna mind rot so I can start getting some things on my board. Uh, 
He's probably got to have big removal of sorts here. Uh, nothing yet. Well, get rid of some of your cards, buddy. All right, auto pay. Get rid of your cards. I had enough. That was his only counter. Come on. Which ones you got? Two spells, so I'm just drawing two cards. A little unfortunate. Um, I want to keep the pressure up, so get rid of this card. Let's get rid of another one. And if it's a land card, then I can make a zombie off it. It was not, so I'm just drawing another card. Everyone attack. Alright, so he's got to have some huge uh, removal on this turn. Otherwise, it's over. Or 8 million rounds of mill. Shattered Sky, I think he can probably cast now. Destroy all creatures, yep, okay. That's fine. He got rid of everything. So, let's see here. We're going to Tiny Bones. We're going to get make you get rid of two cards. Nope, he's still very much holding on to that, but that's fine. Let's get rid of that other one you got there, buddy. Thank you. Now I have so much. I can kill him unless he gets rid of Tiny Bones now. Alright. Yeah, he's searching. You know what? Fine. I'll make you mill. <laughs> oh, I played the... I was a little hesitant to play against the blue-white here, but... You know, you gotta make cards eat the counters. You just gotta try to make sure they're not the really, like, important ones. Ooh, what did I get for a card? Ox of Agonis. When he enters the battlefield, discard my hand and draw three. I guess that's fine. I don't know if I like getting rid of all my cards, but it's probably a method of playing the game that I don't understand. Because I just see, get rid of my hand, that's terrible. Unless it's the last card I play in my hand. What's my, uh, shiny one? Fiery Emancipation. If a sword you control would deal damage to a permanent or player, it deals triple. That is very good. I've lost to that before with my inability to understand what it means by permanent. Alright. One more. One more game. Let's see. Right after this, it's 90 degrees out. It's humid as fuck. I'm going to go sweat up, sweat a lot and take my 65 minute loop that I do for my apartment. So, have AC going. When I get back, it's going to be nice and cool in here. I'm going to relax for the rest of the night. This is a pretty good ramp is the word. It would be perfect if within the next few turns. All right, uh, I'm going to leave it on you actually. I think I don't think I touched you on the last last uh on the last game. What are we playing against? I'm gonna say that this is either uh green or black or green black. It's neither. Uh well we're gonna burglar rat. Let's start getting rid of stuff in your hand. Let's make it two things. Shatter the sky. Let's make it let's get rid of this other one. <laughs> oh, I really hurt myself stepping back and laughing on that. Oh, man. Oh, man. No one likes playing. This is like, if you go against decks that you don't want to deal with, this has got to be, like, right below milling. Because th this, you have to choose the card at least you want to get rid of here. Ooh, what is our reward? Labyrinth of Scophos. 
Remove him from combat. That That's a uh, strong spell. It takes a while to get to it. That one was quick. So let's do another one. And I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'm going to probably lose this one. Law of Average Estate. I will probably lose this one. The last one was just us going up against somebody who probably... Maybe they went up against a couple other games before this and were like, oh man, there were some slogs I barely lost. And then he just got frustrated when he saw what he was going up against and it's just like, uh, I, no. I just punched the mic again. I mean, there's, there, there is that understandable just no. Everyone's got those. All right, this is okay. Waste not turn two. Davriel turn three. He has a large deck. 75... 74, 75, 76, 7, 8, 9, 10. Well, that's fine. He had a mulligan once. Waste not turn two. Ah, we've got ourselves a black deck as well. Baron's pretty gonna pretty nice. I think turn three they've got a destroy enchantment for black. I could be wrong. This is probably just a life's game vampire type thing. And I'm gonna lose to it. He's got something to play. Yeah, it's probably just like uh, a removal of sorts. Like Disfigure or something. Let's get rid of one of your cards. I mean, this is if he's got Graveyard or something, he can probably... Plays right into his hand. Yeah, what is this? Sacrifice Creature Flashback. Interesting. So he's just got weenie control, which he'll probably do the, uh, no, we're doing, uh, just straight up death touch, huh? All right, go ahead. One attack. I'm going to get my money worth out of this at least. That's fine. I don't like that. Sucks a little bit that I'm potentially not going to get good value out of this, but we're going to do it anyway. Get rid of some, another card. One, this is he's definitely probably going to get removed next turn. I do have a flash for a Thieves Guild Enforcer, so I can put that in next turn. Here comes removal for Tiny Bones. Yep. Uh, we're going to go ahead and mill now. Ooh, a Fraxian thingamajig. Scary. What are you... Ah, uh, yeah, see, this is playing directly into his hand. He just needs, uh, one more mana to get on Barely Rights. Although he does need a, uh, whatever the word is, a white for it. So he doesn't have that yet. Uh, a couple of death touches, no. No blocks. Okay, here we go. Um, well, I'm going to force him to get Devotee comes out. All right, you get rid of your last card. It was a murder. Okay, so Tiny Bones comes back out. Mill some more, got rid of another removal. Great, no attacks. All right, so if I can live... He needs... Yeah, this is good. Activate ability. We'll make him mad. Oh, he's got a card in his hand. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I deserve to lose this. See, I told you. My inability to play is going to be the reason I lose. Castle of Lockwain. Liliana Stewart comes out. He does not have an answer for it. We're going to... What are we going to do? Death Baron? No, we're going to Liliana Walker of the Dead. We're going to make you get rid of a card. Perfect. No attacks. Now I have control. He has to... Uh, I got the next two turns. I can get rid of stuff in his hand. Because he doesn't have enough to... 
get this uh, barrier rights guy back. I'm fine. You got go ahead, hit me. I don't care. All right, so you don't have anything in your hand. Take ten. Take three. You are lethal next turn. So, unless you got a way of wiping the board, you're, uh, done. Or if you got a way of getting rid of Tiny Bones, I don't think you do. I think I've won this one. No, I'm fine, go ahead. By all means. Let's get rid of that card in your hand, buddy. Eh, you know what? One murderous rider's fine. Ping. I, no in I get a zombie off of that. Goes into the battlefield tap. I don't care, buddy, because uh, I just won. Thank you, Tiny Bones. Oh, what a streak. A glorious, glorious streak. I've got... There's, there's more pings on this level. Bronze tier 1. Ah... I did not expect to win all of these. But hey, I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth, and neither should you. I'm having a lot of fun with this still. I mean, winning makes anything awesome, so I'm going to continue doing this at least two days a week. Going into next week, maybe I'll do more. Let me know what you think. Um, so until next time, see you folks. Have a good one.